Welcome back. It's been a few weeks since the last video. This video we are making some wall art using some marine parts. This is a cowl off a mercury outboard. As you can see, it's in really rough shape. Lots and lots of coats of paint on here throughout the years. And what we're going to do here is we are going to strip this cowl completely. We're going to use some Petty Easy Speed Strip. Easy Speed Strip is a chemical stripper. We're going to apply that to the cowl. We're going to use a couple foam brushes, brush that on liberally, let it soak in, let it really eat into the existing finish. Then we're going to come back and we're going to come back, hit it again with that same Easy Speed Strip to remove any remaining residue. From there, we're gonna move on to removing that completely with a little bit of our 120 brushing thinner just to remove the remaining easy speed strip and any remaining paint residue that's left on the surface. Then we're gonna take a little drill brush. We're gonna abrade where the mercury letters are on the side of the cowl here. Then we're gonna go ahead and tape it off. We're gonna tape off pretty much the majority of the cowl here everything except for where we want to put our paint in the mercury letters. We're using Pettit Propoxy. It's a 2K aerosol. First thing you do is you take the little button out of the cap, smack it into the bottom, and then you're going to want to shake that can for two minutes to make sure the catalyst mixes with the paint. This is a wonderful product, extremely durable. It'll make this piece of wall art last forever. It's way overkill for what we're doing here, but I actually happened to have another project I was going to use that for, so I just used a little bit for this project as well. Then I came in, I sanded the cowl with 220 to start just to remove any of that heavy oxidation or the propoxy paint that was on there. Then I came back with 400 grit and I abraded all the existing painted surface. Want to make sure I got a good mechanical etch into that something that paint will stick really well to. Then came through with the 120 brushing thinner again, cleaned up any of that sanding residue, any fingerprints, any contamination on the surface. Then I came through and I taped off the areas of the cowl that I did not want to paint. So I wanted to save that aluminum uh, band that's there. I want to keep that nice and clean. Did a really nice job sanding that, prepping that and making sure we removed all the oxidation. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some Propoxy Vivid Red. Again, another 2K aerosol. This is a very bright, very nice finish. And I really like the red finish on this cowl part to start with, so I decided to go right back with the Vivid Red aerosol. And again, this would be way overkill for this project, but I was using both of these aerosols for another project around the corner, so. Um, you certainly want to, you wouldn't want to use these aerosols on something uh, like a little small piece part like this um, and not use the whole can up. So this was just to put a few coats on while I had a, another project waiting on the side. So I did a few coats on this. I wanted to cover that blue really well. I would have primed this if it was going to be exposed to the elements or, you know, needs extra durability or adhesion, but... Again, this was just wall art, so I didn't have to go too crazy. Few coats with the Vivid Red Propoxy 2K Aerosol. And this product is extremely durable. It applies very nicely. You can see it's got a very beautiful fan pattern to it. Little to no orange peel. It's a really, really, really nice product to use. Buttery smooth, if you will, when you're applying it. And then what you're going to see after we get done here with the aerosols, we're going to go ahead and we're going to take off that tape. And then we're going to get the great reveal seeing the final product here before we went ahead and we attached it to a nice piece of teak to make the actual display out of. Well, I hope you guys like this one. This was another fun video for me. Again, just another nice piece of wall art. Nice thing for the office, and I hope you like it. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments. Like and subscribe, and we will see you soon.